I guess it's hard to let someone know all the time how much that means to you and how, how big a part of you they are. So I guess it's marrying her just commits that and lets her know that I'm not going anywhere. I'm here, I'm, I'm here to stay. I swear I wish I could reach your mind Cause I ask the same question every Sitting here writing this, <laughs> I can reflect on our past and I can reflect on the good times which seem to be endless but I can also reflect on the struggles which have made us so strong. I've never been able to completely give my trust to anyone but with you it's become second nature. I'm so excited to see you walk down the aisle and enter the world as Mr. and Mrs. Tomlinson. Reese, I am so happy that you came into our family and I am so proud to call you my dad. You mean so much to me and mum. Love you both. I can never be the same. When, when he speaks of you, I hear the love in his voice. When he looks at you, I see the love in his eyes. And I know just from knowing Reese, I know him to be a dedicated, trustworthy and loyal person. And I know him to take that attribute and transfer it into his marriage. I know your relationship will stand the test of time because of these virtues. So just breathe. Today means that she gets to know like how much. <laughs> so she gets to know how much she means to me. My heart it beats and I can't seem to dream. Baby, you know that I want mine. And see him walking her down the aisle, it's him giving her away to me. And standing by my side as, as my son. So I'm absolutely excited to have him and Jesse over to I can never be the same. I plan to love you all my life. Until you meet your chariot. Jesse, obviously, you look stunning. I, I know you had concerns about the weather, but uh, I swear to God, heaven parted and the sun shone just to see your radiance tonight. Isaiah, you are my son, and I'll always be there for you. Thank you for loving me. Thank you for always making me laugh. And thank you for allowing me to marry your mom. You break my heart wide open. When you walked into my supplement store and said, you're not Bobby, I thought to myself, you're right, I'm not Bobby. But looking at you, looking at me, I felt drawn to the person you are. I knew you had a story that I wanted to read. I didn't realise though, at that very moment, we would be beginning our own story. And that would be my favourite.